Yo, what's cracking YouTube? Woohoo! Sports cards back with another video live from Las Vegas. So today I am doing a triple quickie. Yes, you heard me right. Triple quickie. Uh, trying to get into the groove of things. Las Vegas been here for about a week now. Trying to get settled in. I got stuff to do. Lots of stuff to do. I got lots of magic boxes to open. I got to order some sports boxes and crack those. I'll probably just bring them all back to the Philippines. Crack them there. Got to get back onto Snodzilla's uh, website so I can start getting into some breaks and junk like that. By the way, everyone should go check out his website. It's up. It's running. It's awesome. It, it looks awesome. It's so easy to use awesome discounts awesome prices go to his website uh, I guess I should have the website here I could probably bring it up but if y'all need to know it just let me know and I will I will let you know um, or let him know or go to his uh, YouTube channel and it's all over there but uh, yeah awesome website I'm so happy for him that he's got that website up uh, I just need to jump back on but I'm trying to get the timing right you know uh, get everything settled here first but um, I gotta send them all my cards too so we can have some big old auction or auctions because it's probably gonna be several so come out and support those when he has them now let's get started with what we have here uh, this was waiting for me when I got here at one touch sports collectibles I'm trying to figure out who that was if you look at the date on it but oh, I was wondering if I cross that out uh, July 2018 that was uh, last year I think sometime uh, since I was here last year up until about April so get to see what that is um, we have some more magic now I have five packs of Mirage they are foreign Mirage from Japanese to Spanish to German to Portuguese to I, I don't know I've opened them up and seen but uh, I can't read all those languages so I don't know I'm not gonna bust those though because the foreign ones in my opinion for loose packs are not easy to find they could be out there on eBay I don't know but these are some older cards uh, the Mirage brand and so a little more valuable too unlike today's or recent days booster boxes and so I'm gonna hold on to those those are more for investing same with these I so want to get into stronghold I I, I really want a booster box but they're about 1500 bucks a pop uh, really want the Mox diamond I'm looking forward to it but there's um, five packs here all foreign as well there was a English pack so I'm going to break that one for you today because if I do it by an English box then I'll have a whole bunch of packs of that or it seems like the English version is a little easier to find and maybe cheaper so I will open that one now hopefully we're looking for a sliver queen or mox diamond snaring bridge um, but a little older pack for you all uh, let me check by the way these uh it just came from the bottom of the box so that's why yeah 1997 which is pretty old Consider magic just came out in what 93 94 something like that so pretty old pack there i should have gloves because the older cards don't work well without gloves but i don't do the gloves so jack frost loan me your gloves um or open boosters <laughs> loan me your gloves <laughs> Um, and then I got two packs of these I got a while back when they came out. I had my friend who worked at Target get them for me. Um, so they were pretty uh, discounted. And uh, we got two packs, two re uh, rack packs or whatever, or retail packs, rack packs of the Prism. So we'll get into that. So four minutes already in. Typical woohoo fashion. Let's do it. All right. So start with this. So one touch sports collectibles. I don't, oops, just hit the camera. My bad, my bad, my bad. Don't know if I was expecting anything back then uh, or if this is random. I thought it'd be easy to rip open. Hold on one second. Are you kidding me? Maybe if you had the glue from a year ago is already stuck like a mother. So, all right, so we'll find out what this is. Let me see, make sure there's nothing like with an address on it or anything. What is this from? Oh, I know what this is. Okay. I remember what this is. 
Melvin Ingram signed 90 out of 99 from Strata. What year is this? Uh, 2012, Tops Strata, Melvin Ingram. Not a Chargers fan. I didn't pay for this. I think I won a giveaway. It was like some random giveaway or some kind of giveaway. Melvin Ingram autograph. I said, I'll take it. Cool. Send it here. There you go. So we got a nice Melvin Ingram auto. Sticker auto, right? Yeah, sticker auto. But pretty cool. Yeah. I mean, I'll take freebie stuff anytime, right? So that was that. Pretty cool. All right, let's get into one of these prism packs. We'll go ahead and do the stronghold pack, and then we will get up into the other prism pack just to kind of mix it up a little bit. Um, <clears throat> opened up a lot of prism football this year. Let me drop the camera a little bit, make it easier on me. Opened up uh, quite a bit of prism, but not retail prism, obviously, because it was nowhere near a, pre a retail store. So, all right, we got Michael Thomas. Uh, Brandon Marshall, shiny cards. It's been a while since I opened up Prism. Uh, Lumination, come on, focus. Alvin Kamara, Prism, and Marquette King. Hmm. Interesting. All right. So it was pack one. We are looking for the go, uh, green pulsars, I think, or the red. I, I don't know what any of the colors. Uh, autographs can be found. Uh, Stefan Diggs, Alejandro Villanueva, Jordan Lastly, rookie. Shout out to Card Dreamer, and Patty Mahomes. Nice second year. Oh, Patrick Mahomes action. All right, oh, we got a green coming up. Is it going to be a rookie? We got Brandon Cooks, Josh McCowan, Pierre Garçon Green. Shout out to Koo Toads. A little green action for you there, brother. Pierre Garçon and a Gino Atkins. So he's got some color up in there. Now I think this is a red, white, and blue. Yep, bonus pack. Dan Bailey on the back, and Jared Goff on the front. I've seen to pull a lot of Jared Goff. And James Washington, rookie, smacked in the middle of the sandwich. So pulling a lot of James Washington, too. <laughs> if you all saw my airplane flight. Actually, I'm going to open up the Heather Prism and then finish off with that Stronghold just because I'm pretty nervous getting it up, up into there. I bought them off of DA Card World. It was about... 100 bucks a little over 100 bucks for six packs and five packs of the mirage is another 100 bucks i know it's quite expensive but you know they run about 25 30 bucks a pack something like that and i had to get some older stuff which i'm going to probably get even more of older stuff coming up cam chancellor dalvin cook we got a ronald jones rojo instant impact flashy shiny prism and a Josh Gordon no longer in the history books. If he was ever in a history book, <laughs> as many times as a player can move teams, come in and out of the NFL. Juju, the Dominican Sioux, rookie of Deontay Burnett for them Titans. Shout out to Madden Crazy Bobby. And Andrew Luck. <clears throat> All right, last pack, then the red, white, blue pack, and then we'll finish it off with the hold strong, strong, strong hold green. Come on, rookie. DJX, Jeremy Hill. It is a rookie. Who that gonna be? Oh, Kiki. Shout out to Carl Emmons. Four of them Texans. Devin Funches. Guess it'd help if I had my sleeves out. That's a beautiful card. I'll let y'all see it. Prism green it is the retail green probably nothing too special but hey it's a rookie kiki kiki shout out to adam ha kiki do you love me <laughs> yeah there you go cool and you know what i should just look through these packs oh that's actually a pretty good one good rookie and okay and that's a vet 
me see if I got it right. Matt Ryan. Oh, no, I knew Denzel Ward. Yeah, and Matt Ryan. Yeah, and uh, Deion Lewis in the middle. So pretty cool. Denzel Ward. Shout out to Snodzilla. Just talking about him and Todd Burlingame. And there you go, Denzel Ward. That's coming to you, Snodz brother. Bam. There you go. So pretty nice red, white, and blue there. All right, the moment for you MTG fans have been waiting for. So if you are not an MTG fan and you don't want to watch this, then you can hang up um, or you can watch it for fun. Man, I don't uh, See, it's got that glue on that. That's from the glue from the box. It hasn't been open though, but it's just about to get open. Ooh. Some of these older packs, man, you just get kind of nervous. All right. There's a first uncommon on the back. You gotta have to kind of look at the uncommon. All right, so we're gonna start at the top, go one by one and flip them. So these are your commons. All right, so spined worm. All right. Tend to be a little more careful here with these. Uh, flowstone blade. Look at the artwork on these, man. That's pretty awesome. I love the artwork of MTG. <clears throat> so beautiful. Uh, get that light out of the way, man. Jeez. Sky Shroud Archer. Summon Elf. One for a 1-1. One, one. Target creatures with flying. It's minus one, minus one until end of turn. Cool. That's actually not too shabby. Contempt. The Contempt of Court. I mean, it's like people that make up comic books, man. It's just got some awesome artwork here. Cannibalize. That guy looks like he's ready for a nap. <laughs> All right. Next one, Craven Giant. Coming out of the cave. Craven Giant. He's craving some food. Craving some bones. Foul Imp. Does he smell foul? Is he just foul? What? For two flying, when Foul Imp comes into play, lose two life. Two, two. Imp. An imp for imp. And a shock. Oh, you just shocked me. That's kind of cool. Shock deals two damage to target creature or player for one. That's pretty cool. It's a very nice card right there for uncommon for one. Conviction. Alright. One, two, three, four. Okay, two more uncommons. Lowland Basilisk. Lowland. Not a highland, a lowland. Alright. And mind games. Playing mind games with me? Yeah, buyback, too. It's got an old buyback. Alright, this one's the rare, so we'll move that over. And here's your uncommons. Come on. Focus. Wall of bosoms. I mean, blossoms. Wall of blossoms. Wall. Yeah. Wall of blossoms. Boom. Ooh. Contemplation. He's contemplating his life. Whenever you successfully cast a spell, a spell gain one life. Cool. And we saw this one. Mog Maniac. He's a maniac. Maniac. Oh, oh. Never Mog Maniac is dealt damage. It deals an equal amount of damage to target opponent. Cool. And the rare. Can we get that Mox Diamond? Sliver Queen. Even Unsnaring Bridge. Come on. Verdant Touch. Yeah. Wah, wah. Wah, wah, wah. had an epiphany here hold on one second I'm going to check something out for a second where did I see okay weird I wanted to see something here there's something I'm not seeing here where the set symbol is, how come it looks the same as an uncommon? Did they not check 
change the set symbol back then? I don't know. Maybe you magic players out there can show me because those two symbols look exactly alike if I'm not mistaken. Anyways, I'm not going to take up any more of your time. That is our rare Verdant Touch. Not the greatest, but it's okay. Now, I might get into those one day. I don't know, but uh, I kind of want to hold on to them. It's kind of unique having some of those foreign language cards. Um, yeah, So, but I am going to try to get a box of Stronghold along with a million other boxes of stuff for your viewing pleasure and my opening pleasure. But anyways, thanks for staying tuned. It's not really a quickie. It would have been if I kept it under 10 minutes, but whatever. So appreciate y'all watching. God bless and woohoo!